Hi, welcome to Steam and Zenix 12 video tutorial. It's a follow up to my last one. I want to show you how to get a very similar part, not identical, but very similar with face plans and a limit curve. So I want to reuse part of this model here. So I will delete one of these extrudes, not this one, but that one, which will delete all the children. So go for delete confirm and so my M, my part is already cleaner I don't need this one and I will not use the trimmed here so I go for deleting that trimmed sheet here and that other one as well which means I've got all those extrudes in there full length and I want to use this sketch here and make a new extrude go for a sheet go for a draft from section 2 degrees 40 millimeter and okay because I want to use that edge here as limit curve therefore I want to extract that edge like this go for tangent curves and confirm now I could move those two up to this point and hide this extrude and with the same sketch another extrude again go for a sheet go for a draft with two degrees from the section but the end should be until selected until this extrude here and confirm now let's trim that sheet this I want to keep that's the tool and confirm now I want to do face blend with this curve as limit curve so go for face blend two face that's the first face reverse that direction select the second face this one again reverse that one and let's go for limit curve not for radius go for limit curve and the tangent limit curve would be that composite curve right here so go here click there and now I should be able make this to all trim the body to the blend and sew all faces and confirm and you get a very similar surface as you will get with the section surface now i could already trim here and there and then make a mirror so let's go for trim sheet trim this sheet here with that one and that one here and confirm yes now let's mirror this one and go to home go to more mirror geometry there you go and with that plane here that's the Y set plane and confirm let's sew this surface and that surface those two the mirrored one with the original one and because I've already trimmed it it cannot be converted into a solid by accident so use this one and that one and sew it now i want to use face plans just one little problem you cannot do it with a limit curve that would be nice but it's not able to do so the program so that would be this curve here just to show you and the other one was done with a plane so i had here some sort of limiting plane and of course I can delete the 
that second plane that was this one because I don't need it anymore and I can offset that curve on that face here so go for a curve go for offset curve face select this here select the face five millimeter in that direction that's okay so sadly it's not possible to use that limit curve if you want to do it go for surface face blend select this surface here and the second surface would be this one direction seems to be okay but the limit curve will not work sadly it's not possible because there's some sort of change in the curvature here so it will not work at least it didn't work so we'll do a normal face plan which will work with a radius of 25 so go for the first face select the second face check the arrows they look okay and go not for limit curve but for constant and go for 25 millimeter this will work and you could try to trim body to blend and sew all faces nice same over here go for another face blend select the face select the second face and again 25 millimeter trim bodies to all faces and okay and you will see that's not quite the same here because that fillet doesn't go up to that curve but it's still a nice part and I can thicken that one so go for home go for more go for thicken yep select this part and it should go to the inside so turn it around one millimeter confirm let's hide the surfaces and the curves and I'm done so that's very similar but it's not identical and also there is a small difference here not only there but here as well but hope it was helpful hope you enjoyed it if you did like it please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel please subscribe to my facebook cat fan page would be very nice of you i want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well thanks for watching see you to the next one bye bye